Homelander isn't an SCP. But if it were, how would the SCP Foundation contain it? Spoiler warning for the comics and TV adaptation of The Boys. Oh boy. Containing Superman, but trading out the easily exploitable kryptonite weaknesses for narcissistic sociopathy. How fun! If we were working with a TV continuity, we could use our artificial intelligence constructs to troll the web in order to obtain the multitude of damning videos of Homelander's repugnant actions and threaten to release those to the public. Assuming anomalies and magic work the same way they do on Superman in most canons, we could also leverage the subjects caring about its child, Ryan Butcher, to effect compliance as Vought Enterprises did. Lock the child in the room next door to SCP-956, codename The Child Breaker, and call it a day. In fact, let's cover our bases and do both. Of course, in the comics, we don't have a child to blackmail with, and narcissism only bends so far before we start losing containment sites. We should certainly start considering decommissioning options. Hey, let's toss my amulet on him. Do you know how fast that heat vision could cook my burritos? Absolutely fucking not, Bright. The last time we gave you a body that had the power of flight, we had to pay for the dry cleaning bills of the entire neighborhood of <laughs> Ugh. The decommissioning department has been racking its collective brains trying to figure out how to neutralize Homelander. And it seems they reached out for a bit of help. Damn right, nerd. We here at the Global Occult Coalition know that the right thing to do with any supernatural threat is to neutralize it. We only keep that garbage around if it is 100% controllable and useful to us, or we can't just destroy it. Homelander is a particularly powerful suit, and in the comics, he was only defeated by a clone of himself. And that clone was only taken down by conventional weaponry because it was weakened from the previous battle. I am not at liberty to say what sort of arsenal we have at our disposal in front of our super cuddly panty waist friend over here. But I'll just say that if I have to grab one of the Scarlet King himself's spears to take down this red, white, and blue bastard, I will do it in a heartbeat. <sighs> Buffoons. Make sure to like and share this video, comment any creatures you would like to see containment procedures implemented for, and remember that patrons of Site42 get priority on their Conprox requests.